everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel or welcome if I haven't seen you on my channel here before, my name is Ruby. So we are already over halfway through November, which means Christmas is literally right around the corner. The supermarkets have already started to blare out Mariah Carey and Michael Buble. The roses and celebrations are already back in stock, which means obviously it's time to start thinking about presents, compiling a little list, maybe buying a few bits and pieces just to get yourself prepared for Christmas time. And it also means thinking of stocking fillers for Christmas which I always struggle with. I feel like stocking fillers can be really difficult to think of because you have to make them so they're small enough to fit into a stocking, but they're still nice and they're still something that the person would actually want and they would use. A couple days ago, I released my stocking filler gift guide for her and I had over a hundred plus stocking filler gift ideas. So if you wanna see that video, I will leave that in the description box down below. And I thought it was only fair to create a stocking filler gift guide for him as well. So I tried my best to come up with a list of a hundred plus ideas stocking fillers for him but I really struggled with this one so I didn't think of 100 plus but I have 70 plus so I have a big long list here of things so if I am looking down a lot in this video it's because I'm checking what I've written I have a lot of different gifts here I have something for all price ranges and pretty much something for everyone so if you are struggling to think of stocking filler gift ideas then hopefully my list will help you think of some things that you can get for gifts so grab a pen and paper or grab the notes on your phone and let's get through my 70 plus stocking filler gift ideas so I have four different categories of gifts to go through and the first category is skincare slash body care. The first one is some aftershave. You can get those 30ml smaller bottles of aftershave that would fit really nicely into a stocking. Something along the same lines is those aftershave sample kits. The ones that come with those really small, I think they're two or five ml bottles of aftershave. They can just try them out. If you're not really sure what kind of scent to get them, that would be ideal because they can just wear whichever one they like the most. Some miniature skincare. If you just type in skincare miniatures online, you can find loads of different like tiny creams and stuff. If you're not really sure that they'll like skincare, but you want to see if they can try it out or if you know that they want to try out skincare and they want to get into skincare. Some miniature hair care products. You can get like the travel size bottles of hair care products like mini shampoos, mini hair gels, all that kind of thing. And then obviously some mini shower products products. Lush do like mini bottles of their Christmassy shower gels. You can get them one of those and put that in there. A beard care kit, like one of those tiny beard care kits that have like a little brush, like a little razor or something. Just like a small one that you could put into the stocking. Some sheet masks. I've really got my boyfriend into sheet masks so I always put a nice sheet mask into his stocking for Christmas. A good place to get sheet masks is Pure Soul. They do some really good Korean sheet masks. Along the same sort of lines is a foot mask. Those ones that are like socks that you put your feet into and they make your feet nice and soft. A travel razor or a travel razor kit. You know those tiny little razors that come in the box and they're easy to put in your bag or to travel with. You could put a hand cream in there. Hands get so dry in the winter. I like the, what's it called, the one that I like? Yeah, there's one I like that I will put on the screen, but just like a little hand cream. One of those nose trimmers. These are really gross to me, but I know that guys use them, so you could always put one of those in there. Some bath bombs or bath stuff. Lush is my favorite place to go for bath bombs. I bath bums for bath bombs and you can get loads of less feminine like smelling ones if you wanted to as well from there so the second category that i have for gifts is accessories one of those tie clips I'm not entirely sure what these are, but those things. And then along the same lines would be those cufflinks. You could even get some Christmassy ones if you wanted to for like your dad or something. You could pop a new wallet in there. You can get some customized ones from places like Etsy where you can put like a message on there or their initials. Or you could put one of those card holders in there. You know, that can't carry like your debit and your credit card instead of like a wallet and they're easy to take to the shop with you. You could put a new watch in there. You could just put a really nice one in there or you could even put a Apple watch or like a Fitbit in there and have it at the bottom of the stocking for like a last present. A pack of chunky rings. These have become so popular recently. So you could always get a pack of like different assortments of them and just put them in the stocking. Along the same lines as the rings is getting them a new chain. You could have it like tied in like a little gift bag and put it at the bottom of the stocking if it's a really special one. And then obviously a pack of earrings. If you know a guy that wears earrings, you could get him some new ones for Christmas. And also some body piercings. Like if you know someone that has an eyebrow piercing or a nose piercing, you could always get them some more jewelry for those. Some Christmas socks. I know so many guys get socks as like a default present when people struggle to find gifts for their you can't ever have too many socks especially if you've got ones that get holes in them so you could always get them some christmasy ones i feel like i'm going to say this wrong but a snood is that how they're said snood or is it snood i'm pretty sure it's snood but then you say hood is hood 
I'm pretty sure it's Snood. I think these are really good if you know someone, especially that rides a bike during the winter time, because I can't imagine how cold it would be in the winter to try and ride a bike, so they could always just put a Snood over their head, over their face even. And then something similar to that would be just a nice new beanie, if they like beanies. The third category I have for presents is electronics. Bit of an obvious one, everyone already has these, but you get them some LED lights if they don't have them already. And then something similar to that would be those car LED lights, the ones that you put in like, the footwells and they light up the bottoms of your car. I probably explained that really badly. <laughs> More LED lights, but you can get those LED lights to stick to like the back of your TV. And then they make the light, like the wall behind you light up with different colors. Last LED thing on this list, I promise. One of those LED light bulbs that you can change colors with the remote controls. If you get them a new game, if there's a game that they've been waiting for all year that they really want to play, you could put that into the stocking. Some of those controller thumb grips, I'm probably going to explain this really badly, but you basically stick them onto the analog sticks of your controller and they're supposed to help you grip better when you're playing games. If you know someone that has a YouTube channel or just takes pictures with a camera, you could always get them a new memory card or a new battery for their camera. One of those disposable cameras, I love these so much, they take such cute pictures and they're so nostalgic because I remember having these as a kid, but it's nice not knowing what you've taken a picture of until you print it out and it's like a little surprise what you've taken pictures of. An Amazon Fire Stick, if I'm being completely honest, I don't really know what these do because I've never had one, but I think you watch stuff on them. Do you? I don't know. <laughs> one of those phone photo printers that you plug into your phone, they print off like Polaroid type pictures on them. And an extremely, extremely long phone charger. A pack of Bluetooth earphones. Earphones? I, that was a mix between earphones and airpods. I know that these are obviously a little bit more expensive, but if they don't have them and they really wanted them and you wanted to get them as like a main present for their stocking, you could always get those and put those at the bottom. And then something to go along those lines, if they already have airpods, you could get them an airpods case. I really like the ones from Amazon. They're really good quality. Mine have lasted like two years, I think. Those key finder things that you clip onto your keys and then they make a noise when you press a button on something so they help you find your keys. A shower speaker, one of the ones where you like suction it to the wall of the shower and you can listen to music in the shower. Or something similar would just be one of those miniature speakers. A new phone case, if they've already got a phone case you can just get them a new one, it's nice to switch them out every now and then. One of those phone car mounts that you stick on the window of your car so you can have your phone there as like a GPS or to like listen to music and stuff. A wireless charger, one of the ones that you just put your phone onto and it charges it. A Bluetooth a headband or beanie. I have a Bluetooth headband and it really helps me sleep. I just put on some like relaxing music in my ears and it helps me drift off to sleep. Some headset accessories. I didn't really know how to explain this so I'm just going to show you. I have a headset and it's got these like horns on the top of it. <laughs> Like headset horns. So you can get them some like headset accessories. They might not particularly like having horns on the headset, but you can get like stickers that you can just stick on the sides of your headset or just headset accessories in general. Oh, I just dropped my Polaroid camera on the floor. Some of those controller battery packs. If you know someone that just uses AA batteries for their controllers, those don't last very long before they completely run out. You can get the rechargeable ones that you just plug into the wall and charge them up. So if you know the exact type of controller they use and the exact type of charger that you could get, you could always get some, some of those. They would fit nicely into the stocking. Another thing that would be a little bit more pricey is getting them an external hard drive for their console or their laptop if they need extra space or you know they play a lot of games. So the next category I have is food slash drink. Some chocolate coins. This is the first thing I think of when I think of stocking filler gift ideas because they are perfect for stocking. They're so traditional. You can't make a stocking without chocolate coins. Similar to that would be some candy canes. You could even tie them up with a little ribbon and pop those into the stocking. You get some different flavoured ones. I've seen, I've actually seen some pina colada and strawberry daiquiri flavoured ones from B&M. Some of those small boxes of chocolates. Hotel chocolate do a mix, mix and match of I think three boxes of chocolates for for £12 I think. Hot chocolate sachets, again perfect for Christmas and perfect for a stocking. Something similar to that would be those hot chocolate bombs. You know the ones that have like the marshmallows inside and the hot chocolate powder and they melt into milk and they like, make a really nice hot chocolate. The person you're making a stocking for doesn't like chocolate, you could always put some sweets in there instead. A mini alcohol gift set with those little miniature bottles of alcohol, you can get some really good ones from B&M. Some of those miniature bottles of coffee syrups. 
like different flavors you get a couple and put those into the stocking the last category i have i don't know what to call it so i've just called it miscellaneous it's basically all of the things that i didn't know where else they would fit into the gift code some car air fresheners from places like home bargains and b&m you can find some really nice christmasy ones that are like miniature candles and they're christmas scented some concert or game tickets i feel like this would be a really nice surprise if you put in like an envelope and you put those into the stocking and something similar with to that would be an experience like something from virgin experience where you get like tickets to go skydiving or paintballing and you put those into the stocking if you can't think of a specific gift to get someone you could always put a gift card in there for like a clothing store a spotify one a netflix one you could put a card game in there it would be even nicer if you got one that you could play around christmas time we love playing uno around christmas so you could put something like that in there you could put a nice key ring in there i've seen some really cute ones on etsy sheen have some good ones and amazon have some good key rings as well a pack of stickers that they can decorate their games console with or their laptop redbubble is my favorite place to go for stickers you could put a mini little candle in there you could either get some tea lights or one of those little jar candles that would fit nicely in the stocking some stationery if you know someone that's going to be going back to school soon you could get them some new pens or new pencils There's something similar to that would be some art supplies if you know someone that's very creative and they love painting or drawing you get them some little paints or some little paint brushes one of those back scratches you know the ones that sort of like fold in on themselves so they go a bit smaller get one of those and put that in the stocking so if your boyfriend is always asking you to scratch his back you could just get him one of those and you won't have to do it anymore he can do it himself you could put a new bottle opener in there they have some really good ones on places like amazon this is a little bit strange but some custom underwear i've seen some really funny ones on i think amazon and also etsy where you can put your face lo loads of times onto like a pair of underwear so that's something you could get for your boyfriend or something if you know someone that works out a lot you could get them a pack of resistance bands and put those into the stocking you could put a pack of photos in there so a pack of photos of you with the person you're giving the stocking to or you and your family or a pack of photos of things that they really like that they can stick around their room and make a little collage with and that was everything that i had on my stocking filler gift guide for him i really hope that i've helped you come up with a few gift ideas to put in people's stockings this year i still have two more gift guides coming out on my channel i have my gift guide for grandparents and my more affordable gift guides if you want to see any of those then please subscribe down below i'm really trying to reach a thousand subscribers by the end of this year that is my goal for the end of 2022 is to reach a thousand subscribers so if you wouldn't mind helping me reach my goal and subscribing i would really really appreciate it i hope you all have the most amazing week and i will see you in the next video Bye bye